Number five, very common laboratory system to study Boyle's law, okay, right? Uh, P1, V1 is equal to P2, V2, uh, uses a gas trapped in a syringe, right? Something that has a, a variable volume. Uh, the pressure in the system is changed by adding or removing identical weights to the plunger. The original gas volume is 50 mils when two weights are present on top of the plunger. Predict the new gas volume when four weights are added. Now, we're not actually getting a whole bunch of specific information in terms of what these weights are, but we don't have to because we're being asked to calculate a volume when we know the relative pressures. Okay, so for example, V1 is the case under what pressure conditions? When two weights, that's our P1. Predict the new gas volume, that's V2, when four more weights are added. P2. Okay, uh, let's see. So four more weights, four more, more weights. I've helped students before with this problem and I didn't read this right and I said, uh, and I thought it read, predict the new gas volume when four weights are added, meaning you're going from having two weights to having four weights total. But this is actually four more weights, so it's actually six weights total. Right? I've, I've messed up reading this exact same question before. Uh, let's see. But we do have four values. We can use Boyle's Law. So let's give it a shot. Now we're solving for V2. Okay, V2. So let's uh, figure out how to solve for that. Okay. So we'll be left with V2 is equal to P1 V1 over P2. Well, what's the value for P1? Two. Two weights. We don't know what it is, but it's two. Two whatevers. Volume one. Volume one, what is it? 50 mils. Divided by P2, this is four more weights. Two plus four, that's six. All right, so there are no units here. Mills are the only thing that I actually have left. Good thing, because I'm solving for volume. Let's go 2 times 50, then divided by 6. Now, I want, let's see, the only number I'm given here, <laughs> the only number uh, that's a measured value here is my volume 3 sig figs, because 2 weights and 6 weights, uh, those, are, those are count values, and they don't, they don't affect significant figures. So I'm going to go with 3 significant figures. So I'm going to go 16.7 milliliters.